You're hungover. Your boss hit your work. It's shite. Will you pay me the right shite like that? I'll pay you the right shite, that's funny. Your wife's caught you cheating. You have 24 hours to move out of this house. So could oh. things get worse? Oh. The British television premiere of Divorcing Jack, Saturday at 10.20 on BBC Two. I told me I couldn't fight again. The moment Wayne McCulloch's boxing career was over. I did this the test eight days before the fight. But questions remain. Why did they let me train in between? And now further evidence cast doubt. Now that we do have a previous scan in 1995 that did show that the cyst was there. Will he decide to throw in the towel or fight his greatest ever battle outside the ring? Pocket rocket! The third, the third, the third. This is now the fight of his life tonight, 10.35 on BBC One. This is BBC Two. Now, Kirsty Walk with Newsnight. The fate of the American presidency rests with two political swingers on the Supreme Court. Is this really democracy in action? Good evening. The judges of the Supreme Court, political appointees, everyone, are weighing up the arguments which will finally decide the American presidency. But will their judgment undermine the legitimacy of the court itself? Also tonight, who got what after all the horse trading in Nice? Does a bigger Europe mean a better Europe? The possibility of 27 countries, each with a veto, to go with their votes. Who got the bargains and who got fleeced? And going global, Labour puts globalisation, once a dirty word, at the heart of their international aid agenda. I'll be asking the International Development Secretary, Claire Short, why she's now a believer. The Supreme Court has in the past stepped aside from the fray.